thought she was going to jump up here. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I guess if you can see the both of us sitting here, you know what time it is. It's our Yum Box time. And this time we're going to the land of poets and thinkers. And I think you're going to be surprised because it's not at all where we thought we were going. I was thinking like Rome. Yeah, Italy and know. stuff. No, not at all. Not at all. I didn't even know people wrote poems there my rings twisted sorry or or i'm gonna say thought because they probably do think everybody thinks so we're just gonna show you where we're going and it is to germany hopefully everything doesn't fall out because that's normally what happens to me but there it is we're going to germany <clears throat> And I'm mainly German. There's our oh, she's mainly German. I'm not. I'm not. I don't even know what I am. I'm not. I think I don't know. But <laughs> there's our stuff in our box, and and I already ordered the big box. I did it before we even started the video because I'm not messing around with this little baby box anymore. I need more snacks in my life, and this ain't it. It's not cutting it no more. I'm done with this little little half filled box. So we're getting a bigger box next month. We're done with messing around with this little tiny little thing. So, that's what we're doing. Anyways. But it, we looked it up. We Googled it. And apparently there's a lot of poets that came from Germany. I only know one. I didn't know of any. I, I really didn't. And it was only from history class, which was what? God, six years ago? <laughs> I've been out of school <laughs> a long time, so... I couldn't even begin to tell you anything. If you see fur behind me, it's not my hair. And that is not my ear. <laughs> that is the dog. She thinks she has to be in every video. See, she thinks that she is the star. You see her? Mm -hmm. Mama. Mama. She's like, I'm ready for my close-up. What are you doing? <laughs> She's just like, what? Right. What? I have to be, she has to be up there. So, oh, here she's she comes. usually on my lap. Oh, no, she's out of the video now. Anyway, she has an attitude today. I don't know what her problem she's is. She's a diva. Yes, that too. She is a diva. I'm so, a we are going to be trying these snacks out. And if you don't know anything about Universal Yum Box, um, they have three different sizes. The first size is six plus snacks, and I think it's $15. The box that we have is 12 plus snacks and it is $25. And the box that I just ordered, which will be here next month around this same time, is $39. It's $39 and it's like 20 that, yeah. plus snacks. So that will be a better box. Way more snacks because I am a snacker from way back. And this is not going to cut it today. I might have to just go find some more snacks later. I don't know. So we're gonna get into these snacks and I will do my best to try to describe either the nastiness or the goodness. One or the other. All right. What are what are we eating that we cannot pronounce for the Nuffles? life of us? N Nuffles? No, Nuffles. 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 We're probably gonna have a Nuffle of them. Nuffles. Uh, looks like meat and cheese. It's all I get from the oh, picture. Oh, Jesus. Why, every box that we get, they use meat and cheese to make something. Something. Oh, it says sh Schinken and Koss Nuffles. Ham and cheese corn snacks. That's what that is. German, for Germans, there's no such thing as too much ham and cheese. Exactly. That's what I had for lunch, rolled up ham with cheese. Huh. Their typical breakfast, eggs with ham slices and cheese on bread. Second breakfast, an open-faced ham and cheese sandwich. Dinner, a platter of rolled ham and cheese, pickled vegetables, and bread. In between, ham and cheese crisps. I guess they're just ham and cheese people. So we're going to try these. It kind these. of smells like Cheez-Its. Oh, boy. I like, I like, I like Cheez-Its, though. like brand of Cheez-Its. I don't know. Well, it looks you like a... smell it. It looks like a mask. It looks like a window. Like hmm. a big window. Hmm. Oh boy. Hmm. That's not bad. Pretty good. Kind of tastes like bacon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like cheese and bacon. <laughs> <laughs> Said bacon. That's, that's her that's her word. Bacon! Wanna bite? <laughs> she stole it. 
<laughs> That's not bad. It's really salty, though. Mm -hmm. It's pretty it good. salty. I'm not going to give the dog any more, though, because it's pretty salty. But it's good. It does taste like some bacon. Mm. All right. Not bad. Not bad. So far, so good. But that's the first bag, though, so. All right. Oh, Lord, another word we ain't going to be able Ooh, to Oh, I think it's out. like sour cream with onion. That's what I can see from the picture. Oh, yeah. I can't An onion really. and chai. Oh. Maybe. Mm. Uh, Let's see here. Zweibels. It says XOX Zweibels. Onion flavored corn rings. Hmm. Every October, hundreds of thousands of people gather in the city of Weimar for one reason or one reason, for one reason and one reason only. Onion. Boiled meat with mushrooms and onions and liver with raw onions. Ugh. I would like it. Ugh. I love Ugh. onions. I'm not eating nobody's damn liver. I don't care. You couldn't know. All right, you paid me a million dollars. I'm going to eat a liver. Not a human liver. Why would you eat a human liver anyway? Why the hell am I even talking about human livers? I don't even know. Maybe it smells to them. It's little O's. Little O's. They look like oversized Fruit Loops. Mm. I'm scared. They're not bad. No. There's not They're... much flavor. It's like what with, you can taste it for like a second and then it's gone. Yeah. Yeah, it's like drive-by flavor. It's there and it's gone. That's weird. All right, I think we're going to have some... Oh, oh, Lorenz Curly Peanut Puffs. I like peanuts. Peanut-flavored corn puffs. Yay! You've had corn puffs and you've had peanut butter. Now you're about to have them together. It might sound a bit weird, but after one bite... Of these crispy puffs, you'll soon realize that this unusual German fusion is meant to be. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. These last quite a long time. Oh. I like peanut butter and I like mm. corn puffs. Now, together, we're about to see if we like them together, though. It smells really peanut buttery. Because it's gonna like remind me of Reese's peanut butter puffs. Did you know for Valentine's Day now they have um, heart shapes? Shaped Reese Puff cereal? No. I saw that Walmart. Mmm. You want to eat that too? You should smell it. It smells really peanut buttery. Mmm. It smells like Reese Puffs. It does smell like Reese Puffs. It is a little tiny little, look at it. It's just a little baby mm -hmm. corn puff. Once again, taste it for a second and it's gone. <laughs> oh, and it's got a whole hell of a lot of salt. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god well you can taste like a slight peanut butter taste for a second mm, nothing after that mm. like at the very end you get like hit with like a bunch of salt oh my eyes are watering i need an onion thing again oh that's really salty <laughs> My eyes are watering. I think the onion things are still the saltiest so far, though. Oh. Ugh. Ugh. Wow. Ugh. Okay, are we done with the saltiness? Ugh. Let's see what this is. Ugh. That was really salty. I'm not one to eat much salt anymore. I used to be the salt queen, let me tell you. But I can't eat that salt no more. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't know what any of this says. Well, it's in German, so I don't know what it says either. Let me see if it's translated in English. Let's see. Chocolate-coated roasted almonds with spices. Dewar's mandolin. Mandolin. We have two words to describe Germany's famous Christmas market. Sensory overload. You'll see sparkling net, net, nativity scenes and handmade ornament stalls. Brush up against shoppers purchasing last-minute presents. It's January. It's not Christmas. What's this thing talking These about? These things are hard. Oh, great. I can't say it right, so we're just going to go with chocolate coated roasted almonds with spices. That's what those are. Are they really hard? <laughs> I guess that answers my question. It <laughs> just looks like a powdered sugar thing of poop. Oh, no. It smells funky, too. Can I break it? I don't know. Try it. I'm gonna try and break it. I'm gonna break it. 
Oh, it's still ball. Um, it's not hard. Bite it. It's not hard. Oh, I smushed it. It's not. No. It's soft until you get to the almond. Oh. Why does it sound so hard? Hmm. Well, that's what it looks like on the inside. It's like a, like a brownie on the outside and then almond in the middle. It's like chocolate mousse kind of like yeah. texture, but mm. not bad. Mm -mm. I think the sweets are going to win this this box over. You watch and see. I don't know. Almost looks like mold. Oh, God, no. Mm -mm. Oh, wait, it's upside down. Sorry, guys. What is that? Like marzipan or something? I don't know if it's... This one? Oh. That? Yeah, marzipan. Fruitcake with raisin and marzipan. Oh, I don't like raisins. Conditor marzipan Stalin. Quick, what's the first thing that comes to your mind when we say fruitcake? Nasty. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody crazy? I don't know. <laughs> Did your face just scrunch up in disgust? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> her's dead. <laughs> I don't like it. Cause she's chicken, she's chicken. <laughs> Not really fruity, but I don't know. That's cause it's fruitcake. <laughs> <laughs> it's nasty fruitcake. <laughs> no, it's so gross. L, yuck, and L. Mm -mm. No, uh-uh. Hurry up and eat it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. oh. That's so disgusting. They should be ashamed of yourself. No, don't eat that ever. So far, that's the only thing I really don't like so far. That's terrible. I just don't know why they would even send that to us. Mm -mm. No. Yuck and gross. Nope. No, don't ever eat that, guys. Don't ever eat that, guys. What's this? Trust me, don't eat that ever. I don't know, but it's probably gross, too. Milk chocolate. Nothing. Milk chocolate with puffed rice cereal, hazelnuts, and cocoa cream. Is there one or just, is there two? Oh, there's two. I think there's, there's two. Gone. Hazelnut sun rice is what it's called. You know how school kids are always trying to trade for better snacks during lunchtime? A turkey sandwich for peanut butter and jelly? An apple pie for a banana or milk carton of milk for a juice box. Well, in Germany, the one snack that everyone wants to get their hands on is these. We'll see. We'll be the judge of that. It smells good. It looks good. It looks like, uh, what do you call them? One candy bars? With the... <laughs> <laughs> She's like, let me try. Hi, puppy. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Can't have that. It has chocolate on it. She's so funny. <laughs> She's like, just let me try. Just one try. Mmm. <laughs> Ew. Ew. No. Mm mm. What is that taste in it? I don't know. What the hell is that? At first I liked it, but now uh uh. -uh. What is in there? Mm -hmm. You taste it? Mm hmm. There's something in there that ain't supposed to be in there. Mm. No, no, no. What does that taste? Oh, ill. That's like some kind of like ill. I know there's something that ain't supposed to be in there. It's not ill, ill. I'm going to find it too. Do, 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 do. Ill. Ill. Barley? Oh, oh, that was bad. I didn't have a chocolate thing. That, it tasted like they put, like, chicken base in it or something. Mm -hmm. Something's not right in that. Mm -mm. Oh, that, oh, oh, no. Uh-uh. We should have just split one. Yeah, we should have. This is going right in the garbage. That's where that's going, right along with the marzipan. Because that, that's where they go in the garbage can. Marzipan, garbage can. <laughs> that's where it's going, in the garbage can. All right, let's see what the heck else we got here. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh no, no, no. You're not gonna like it. I told you, I've warned her, I've warned her, I've warned her. <laughs> told her. Mm -hmm. Premium milk chocolate hedgehog slice. 
warned you. Is there seriously like a hedgehog in here? Choco <laughs> Monk Poppy Seed Bar. White chocolate with poppy seeds. If you live in the U.S., you've probably only seen poppy seeds on bagels because that's where poppy seeds go. Not in chocolate bars. And well, bagels, maybe an occasional lemon muffin, but things are different in Germany. Walk into a local bakery and you'll be bombarded with countless speckled desserts from poppy seed rolls, iced poppy seed braids, poppy seed coffee cake, bread pudding, blah, blah, blah. Oh, I'm not looking forward to this at all Why by any means. Why you hedgehog? I have no idea. Maybe they cut a hedgehog up and put it in the chocolate. I don't know. I'm scared. They took to something in here. I'm scared. Oh, it's broken in half. Here you go. You're going to have half and I'll have half. I don't want half. <laughs> it smells like dark chocolate. I swear, it's like every other country only has dark chocolate. You never get a regular milk chocolate bar. Oh, it's dark. I don't want a whole piece. I don't even want a whole half. I don't want a whole nothing. I don't see no poppy seeds because no, they're see. little, so maybe we won't even notice they're in there. I can feel them. The poppy seeds. They're little tiny. Mm -hmm. At first, when you bite it, you kind of taste like you're eating a poppy seed bagel. Mm hmm. Okay, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. The chocolate is a little like bitter, mm -hmm. but it's not too bad. Phew! Thank you, Lord. Thank you. I eat it. Thank you. Okay, I can handle that. Nobody better tell me it was a hedgehog in here. Or I know. <laughs> Why it even says hedgehog on it? I will never know. But I'm not even going to try and find out. I'm not reading the ingredients. Nope. Not doing it today. All What's right. This? What's next? That wasn't too bad. All right, all right. You know, chocolate Ooh. with raspberry? Yeah, chocolate with raspberry cream filling. Him beer cream chocolate. Dark chocolate with raspberry cream. See, told you, dark chocolate. We're not sure we would have survived through much of the 18th century Germany. Why? Because there wasn't any chocolate. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't survive. When chocolate first arrived in Germany, it in the 1700s, it was considered a luxury. Reserved only for aristoc... How the hell do you say that word? Aristoc... Aristocracy? Aristocracy? <laughs> I don't know something. I can't say that word. I have oh, no shit. That's really soft. Uh, I, I can't say the word. Aristocrats? Aristocrats? I, I think Aristocrats. that... I don't know. Yeah, that, that word. And the wealthy. It was reserved for rich people. That's how we were going to say it. Hmm. And it was made by hand, which was a slow and costly process that required extremely skilled that. craftsmen. So you couldn't get it unless you were rich and you mm. had a lot of time. All right, let's see what the... Ooh, yeah, I broke a piece look off. at that. It looks yummy licious. No. It's not. She said no. Oh, God. <laughs> hmm. It's very sweet, though. Mm -hmm. I, so was, I don't like chocolate-filled anything, really. Once it's, like, caramel, yeah. like when you get, like, the cherries and the creamy stuff, no. I it's, just think chocolate should be plain. I can't get past the... It's so super sweet. It is very, very... Like, they just put confectionery sugar in the middle of dark chocolate. That's what it tastes like. Like, it would make my teeth hurt. Give me some peanut butter, and I might eat yeah. it, but... Oh, I would have been happy if they put stuck peanut butter in the middle of this. I mean, it is very sweet. That would satisfy, one bite would satisfy your sweet tooth all day long. Uh, What's this? Yeah, that's another poppy seed one. Oh. I, you don't want to try it again? <laughs> Wafers with lemon cream. It is, I, I think you say Zitron Wafflin. Wafflin? I think that's how you say it in German. I'm not sure. I'm not German. Sounds broken. <laughs> it probably is. It travels, you know, all the way from all the way from New Germany. Jersey. <laughs> That's where it came from. From Germany to New Jersey to New Jersey to here. <laughs> Makes you wonder: do do they ship it? 
They have. You know, where do they ship this from? Is it really? What are you doing? You dork. Why? Are you, she's a diva. I'm telling you. She's doing that for attention. Yeah, because we're not paying attention to her. Uh -huh. She does like a little fake cough. Honest to God. And then you rub her neck and she stops immediately. Here you go. Okay. I don't know how I did that, but we got it open. Looks Come like on. you cut it. No, I just like unzipped it. <laughs> I don't know. There they are. Lemon wafers. It's very lemony. Mmm. It smells like over. pledge. Mama, stop. Yeah. Mmm. Stop, Mama. Holy cow. Yeah, very lemony. Oh my goodness gracious. Whoa. Ooh. That's good, but you can literally only have like one little baby bite and you're done. Ooh. Ooh. That's Ooh. got a powerful uh, lemon in it. It's like take a lemon head and times it by like a hundred and it's that lemony. Like I'm trying to find our yum bag part. What the hell? Where is it? I can't find it. Yeah, we got two things. Yeah. That's it. Mm -hmm. Two little candies. Probably because we got so much candy in the rest of the bag. So, yeah, four one, is, <laughs> one is called Mr. Blubber Lucky Gluck Coins. Ah, they're cool looking. One is cola, one's lemon, one's raspberry, cherry, or orange flavored assorted sherbet candy. They're all the same. Oh, well, then we didn't I get a variety. So. Oh, no. They might be different. It says that you can get a couple different kinds. And then bo Bomi Sour Fruit Toffees. Apple, passion fruit, grapefruit, or currant flavored assorted chewy candies. So. I don't know. They kind of look me. different. But, but, like, all three of these ones look the same, and that one looks different. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. It says they're, are they fizzy candy? Yeah, fizzy, fruity, fresh. Well, we'll be the judge of that. I'm just like gonna fizz out of your mouth. Uh -huh. Like a rabid squirrel. I wonder, yeah, they have, one has a, oh, they have a, like a horseshoe or a, um, a four leaf clover on it. We tried both. Yeah, might as well. Let's open it up. Look, it does say Mr. Blubber, Mr. Whatever on it, Mr. Blubber. Mr. Blubber. 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 The child proof. Can't open them. They're dummy proof. Can't. Get off. Can't open them. They smell good. They smell sour. Ugh, ew, ew. Smell it. Smell it. I smell it. It smells like cow shit. I swear to God. I swear <laughs> to God. Here, smell, smell shit. <laughs> it smells like cow shit. I swear to God. It smells like cow shit. <laughs> It kind of smells like mine. It smells like cow shit. I swear to God. <laughs> Here, eat it. It smells like cow shit. But don't it? A little. Oh. No. What's that say about us eating it then? I don't know. We're full of shit. <laughs> <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> We're about to be. All right, I'm about to put the whole thing in my mouth. Let's go. Ready? One, two, three. I'm scared. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like it? No. It kind of tastes like a big ass like Smarties to me. It's not fizzing. <laughs> oh, it is. Suck on it more. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. I like it. Ew. It's like Alka Seltzer. You don't like the fizz? It's not fizzing. <laughs> Mine is. It's not fizzing. It's a dud. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's a dud. Can you see it? It's fizzing. It's like Alka Seltzer. Plop, plop, fizz, fizz. Tastes better than Alka Seltzer. Oh, not a relief, though. It's like chalky. Like, mm -hmm. yeah. It's like chalk. It does smell like cow shit, though. I like it, though. It smells like cow shit. I don't care. It did. I don't know what cow shit tastes like, though. So I can't say that it does taste That's like good. cow shit. <laughs> it just smells like it. I know, because we live next to a farm, so. 
I got horses behind my house. Mm hmm Yeah. I like it. It's like I'm eating a, a stick of chalk. That's it tastes like. to me like a big ass Smarties. It's too gritty. She what are you doing? She's still doing that. Like, I'm choking crap. She's trying to get attention over here. Mm -hmm. You are. She, my dog is, like, she thinks that she needs attention all the time. Puppy. <clears throat> She's looking at you like, what? <laughs> Hello? Are you talking to me? Excuse me. I'm coming. Hi. To see you. <laughs> candy from no, no, no. She always thinks she's got to be in the video. Punk. Here mm. she comes. Bite it. Mama. Bite it. Stop trying to be in the on the table. She's like, what? Give me a bite then. My mouth is full of fizz. Oh, God. No, Mama. Oh. <laughs> full of chalk. <laughs> what is fizzing? Ugh. Told you. <laughs> it fills your mouth with fizz. It's like eating alka salt through them. <laughs> mm. Hi. You know what it reminds me of? When I was a kid eating a zot. Mm hmm. What would remind me of? Zot. You gave me my first zots. Mm hmm. Ugh. Scared the crap out of me. That's what reminds me of zots. Hi, Mama. No. All right, we got one more to eat. Oh, I'm glad that's gone. Woo, thank you, Jesus. You don't want your next one? No, I don't want that thing. What is this? You say mint fruit or something? That is um this sour is fruit toffees. This is... Mama? No, you jerk. She is trying our patience today. I don't know today. what that says. It says there is... Maraguaja? I don't know. I got grapefruit one. <laughs> The rest of them are that one. There's eating. apple, passion fruit, grapefruit, or current, current, current. That says maraguaja or something. Mm -hmm. That's what yours might says. be. Current, current, current. Mine says current, grapefruit. Current. I have the only grapefruit one. Hmm. Feel like a Starburst. Mm. Mm, not bad. Mm -hmm. Pretty sour though. <laughs> I told you no. it was sour. It kind of tastes the way cat pee smells. I told you it was sour. I warned you. How does it look like? <laughs> the dog's freaking out. She's like, what, what, what? Hi, Mama. What, what? <laughs> but I had the only grapefruit one, and it literally smells and kind of tastes like The other one pee. isn't that bad. It was like, it, almost like an apple flavor. It wasn't bad at all. I want to try the other one. What? It's not bad. That one's not bad at all. But that's it for our Yum Yum box. We hope you enjoyed mm. our shenanigans. I like that one. And our faces and our swearing. You know me. I don't really care. I... It, it smelled like S-H-I-T. Then that's what it smelled like. It, like, it tastes like P-I-S-S. -S? <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> and we don't know is. why we're spelling it because we already said it. So, you know. <laughs> but <laughs> it is it what it is. So, if you want to get your own Yum Yum box, I'll provide the link down below. It's so that you can get your own and suffer through it with us if you'd like. And uh, we're going to read where we're going next month. And remember, it's a super Yum box next month. I already ordered it. So, without further ado, she's going to let us know where we're going to. Next month, we celebrate love of all kinds. Love for spouses, crushes, and yums that we find. From 300-year-old cookies, once made in a churchyard, to famous triangle chocolates, prepare to fall hard. Paris! Mm. I don't know. Probably not. Because I'm never right when I guess. <laughs> I know we guessed Rome last month and it, we're in friggin' Germany. So, I don't know where we're going. Mama. <laughs> I don't know where we're going. Where are we going, puppy? Where are we going next month, buddy? Where are we going? She don't know. She has no idea. She has no clue. All right, guys. Well, that's it. We are out of here. I'll see you in my next video real soon. Bye.